Hello Internet, welcome to another lesson. Today we are going to cover routing in G. So let's figure out how we came about this home page. To figure out how routing works in G, you have to look at the request lifecycle. So let's start by that. So here's the request lifecycle of a E application. First of all, the user sends a request to the entry script and then it resolves the route and it creates a controller according to the route. Remember this, it creates a controller according to the route. And from the controller, we create an action. Then this action go performs the filters, form filters. If filters fail, then we again load the response component and the response component sends it back to the user saying something is wrong. If it if the perform filters passes, then we move on to the action. Controller consists of actions. So in this action, we can either load model or a render and render a view. So we have the model which connects to the database and we have a view component. All right, so in the home page, we are actually not using a model. We are just rendering a view. Let's see in the code. So I have uh, this E application. So the entry point that we just talked about is this web index.php. This is the entry point of our E application. From here, we create a controller. So the controllers live right here. So which controller instance we create depends on the route. If you see, go back to the diagram, you will see it resolves the route and then creates a controller accordingly. From the controller, we create actions of course we go through filters but let's uh, ignore that for right now we create actions so in the home directory home in the home page we have uh, we have site index this is the same as here so we figure out whether this goes to the site index is by the default route I'll show you how to def uh, change the default route later on in a later lesson. But let's keep at it. So this home goes to actually the site index. So the site is the controller name and index is the action name. Okay, so we are in the site controller and we are in the action index. And what does this action do? Like I said, it does not use a model. Here it says it uses a model, but it's only in some actions. For example, the login action, it uses a model. Here, if you check out in the action login, it uses this login form model. So this action uses a model, but this does not. What it does, it simply renders index. So where is this index? To check out the index, you have to go to views and in the views directory, we have a directory for each of the controllers. Right now, we have site controller and we have site folder in the views directory. And here, we have this index.php. And this is rendering this index.php view file. But let's make sure that we come here. So let's do a die statement. We are here. Just to confirm that we are in the right track. All right, it works. Now, let's see what is inside this index direct file. Oops, I opened the login, we want the index. So it says the title is my application. All right, it says my application. Next, we have a div with site index, we have this congratulation string and all of this HTML. All right, so that is how routing works. It creates a controller and then an action. It find, figures out which controller or which action to build is by the, this route. So if I go to about, then it should be site and the action about. There you go. So if I go to login, it should be controller site, and login action. Here we have the login view. 
So now you know how he handles a request and how he does its routing. Yeah, so that is it for this lesson. I hope you enjoyed. Please do join doingitacin.net network and ask all your ye related questions on the ye space. I've already posted my first lesson and I'm going to do the same for my second. So if you have any questions regarding this lesson, please ask us comment on the ye space. This also network was also created using HumHub, which is also a, a product that was built that has been built on top of ye. So okay, thank you for watching. Please do subscribe and like. Have a good day.